as we know, we've had quite a few challenges on the energy sector, which has seen major improvements over the last three years, despite the challenges. Dumso is over, and the power sector is now reliable and stable, ready to support the industrial and businesses for job creation and growth as, as part of our uh, uh, objectives of ensuring stability to underpin um, medium to long-term growth. The car power ship was successfully relocated to Takradi in September 2019 and converted fully to gas by the end of last year, which now means that we will be more able to utilize the gas produced by the Sankofa ENI field, which was, which was delivered to us on a take or pay basis. It also means that we've reduced the amount of heavy fuel oil that we import using up uh, uh, hard end dollars to uh, power the car power ship. The car power ship currently produces between 350 to 400 megawatts depending on the dispatch instructions of Gridco. We've also implemented status to reduce the regulated price of natural gas and to do that we've zero priced the economic rent component of the gas produced in producing fields in order to further reduce the gas price to about $6.08 per million BTU. This is all in a bid to reduce the cost of power generation and the subsequently the cost of electricity produced in Ghana so that industry can operate profitably. We are also in the process of engaging with IPPs to renegotiate some of the more expensive uh, I, uh, power purchase agreements that were put in place which essentially uh, required us to take power um, on a take or pay basis and especially a lot of power that we do not need. We believe this will help eliminate the idle excess capacity 